Hi guys, so I'm just going to review this um, translucent orange Game Boy Color shell I got from AliExpress. Including shipping, this was six fifty US dollars. From the same store, I got this glass uh, screen for I think it was two fifty US dollars, including shipping. I wanted it. That came with, I think, yeah, it looks like it comes with black buttons, but I wanted some translucent buttons, so I went to another store and it says $1.30. But after I paid for it, I realized the shipping was $3.50, so it added up to be about five US dollars just for these buttons, which is half the price of this. So, silly me, so please check the shipping charges on AliExpress and don't forget to use cashback. This sticker comes with the shell as well. Okay, so um, it took it took roughly about a month from China to Australia, even with the corona and all that. And this box is well protected. Um, and this one was for the, the buttons and, this, and bag padded. Both this came a week earlier, and this came a week after that. Okay, let's get to it. You need to have a tri wing screw driver as we fall. Nintendo stuff, so I've had this since the Nintendo DS days changing those shells, so yeah, I'll start opening up. Okay, with the tri-wing, I've removed one, two, three, four, five, six, and then you just remove the case. Comes off really easily. You need to remove that black plate too, so there's four screws you need to remove for this black metal plate and then you just have a content with one two three screws here which is just the phillips head and yeah okay so i'm gonna push this tab up to release the ribbon cable that's holding this motherboard Now that's left is to remove this. You can the screen is like stick stuck to the front housing. So just gently twisting it will lift it up. Give you enough wiggle room to lift try to bend it till it sticks out. I won't bother this because I'm gonna use the glass case okay, so and that's it. One, two, three. Careful the motherboard, the speakers dangling by wires there. Okay, let's put it back with the orange case. Alright, so this is the end product. Um, I guess paying that four five dollars for this oh, it's a bit scratchy. It's not need to sandpaper. It looks nice, blue and orange. Um, that's the button. 
You also can get this game from AliExpress for four US dollars, Shantae. Um, the only thing is this bit here. You can see, squeeze, squeeze, squeeze. Apart from there, I like the look of it. You also can get the IPS LCD screen for about forty US dollars, but I don't play my Game Boy a lot, so I don't think I'll invest. I'll want to put in more money on this game because I got this um, Game Boy for like. 64 Australian dollars at an op shop and nobody spent so much on this and probably <laughs> will go back in, in storage after I'm done with this but thanks for watching okay see ya